Hey Hemophil, I wanted to continue the review of my sparing gloves mittens which were customized for me. I had some time to test them in sparing and I really liked them for the long sword sparing but I do not really recommend them for single sword arming sword sparing. Regarding their protection, they protect really well. Um, I did not feel any pain. I did not get any injuries while sparing in them. You can see some of the marks from the long swords here at the wrist guard or its underarm uh, guard. Um, here on the thumb protection or on the thumb itself, you may see some scratches um, here on the open area, but nothing to complain about. Um, I think the only weak point may be really be the lower part here, but even here didn't fell anything uh, too painful. And of course, um, if you want to protect your palm, you have to wear an underglove. Um, the mobility for the long sword, the mobility is high enough. You can um, quickly change from thumb grip to the normal hammer grip, um, go along the sword grip, no problem. You can throw Zwerchhaus or any other house. For the arming sword or the single sword, it's not that great. Of course, it's often too, too large for them. But my bigger issue is that you cannot really go into the pistol grip, which I use a lot, or change the change from the thumb grip to the normal hammer grip. Um, feels a bit weird because there's not a second hand to stabilize it. So I do not use them um, for the single sword. Regarding the comfort, um, Although they were customized size, I had a few issues with them. A uh, minor issue is that you have a lot of space in here at the fingers, so you can move a lot in it around in this area. Which is not such a big problem if you wear an underglove, which I will do in the future because I've uh, read about some reports of feathers piercing into the palm uh, did not sound so great. My bigger problem with the comfort is here around the sun protection and around the wrist and underarm guards. Um, they move a lot about around the skin and um, apply a lot of pressure here and I even got uh, little scratches on the skin and it's just a bit painful on the back of the thumb. But it got less and less the more I used them, so I hope it will disappear in the next months. So all in all, they are a great sparing glove for longsword and I can really recommend them. They protect really good, uh, really well, and um, yeah, they are mobile enough. I do not recommend them for arming sword or one-handed sword when you move a lot with your hand. But maybe the infinity glove is a better option then. So that's it for me and um, I hope you can use the information from my video to decide whether you want to buy them or not. And I hope we see us in one of the next videos.